Well, guys, if idiots planning to protest foreign problems on a day we remember our war dead wasn't disrespectful enough, you can always be sure that some virtue signaling asswipe will add to it a little bit more. And in what likely shocks very few people, this is coming from the septic spots on the arse of humanity known as Navara Media, featuring such commie cum buckets as Gash the Car and many others. This time, no, it's not actually relating to that trout there, and instead involves a different trout who's deputy head of articles or some shit like that, promoting this abomination that her mother made. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, the virtue signaling pond scum are determined to shit on anything to do with Remembrance Day, and sticking this flag on that is another example of it. I mean, it's a bloody poppy, no flag should be on it ever full stop, but least of all the flag of a country that was part of the Ottoman Empire we fought against in World War One. That in my book makes this poppy a deliberate insult to the people who will be remembered on Saturday, and even more disrespectful than foreign protests being held on the day itself. One, two. Now, yes, some Arabs fought with us in that war, but the point remains that a Middle Eastern flag should not be on a bloody poppy. It's a poppy, it's fine as it is, and it means something. But even more so, an enemy nation, the dead we're remembering, literally fought against. So, so you know, let's, let's not take the piss here. Of course, shitting on anything to do with the UK is something the types at Navarra Media love to do, so this is not surprising, is it? But even with that being said, it should be called out as the level of disrespect is up there with the very best of them. Shit, it might even be at the top. Anyway, though, for now, that's all I got for you on this one. So, as always, thanks for watching the video. Links are down below, and shit, Rod's here to see you off. Pandemic. Pandemic. We're off!